Welcome! In front of me I have Xiaomi Redmi Watch 4 and I'm gonna show you how to pair this watch with the iPhone. First thing we need to do is to turn on our watch. And you can do it by pressing and holding the crown button. Keep holding the button until you see the uh, Xiaomi logo on the screen. Once you see the logo you can release the button and wait until the watch is done booting up. Once it's done, you will see the list of languages on the screen. You can scroll through this list by swiping up and down. Find the language you would like to use. Once you find it, tap on it to select it. And after you select the language, you will need to download and install the Mi Fitness application on the phone you want to pair your watch with. So let's go to our iPhone. Make sure you have the internet connection and Bluetooth enabled. Once you do, open the App Store on your iPhone. In the App Store, tap on the search icon, then tap on the search bar and type in Mi uh, Fitness and tap on search. On the list of apps, you should see this application, Mi Fitness, formerly known as uh, Xiaomi Wear Lite. Tap on it to select it, then tap on the get button to download and install it. And once the application is done installing, you can tap on the open button to open it. In the app, you may see pop-ups about the permissions. For example, the Bluetooth permission. This one is required, so allow it. If you don't see any more pop-ups, tap on start. Here, uh, check the first box because it's required. The second one is not mandatory, but if you want to, you can also check it and then tap on agree. Now let's select the region. So tap on region. Scroll through the list, find the region you want to use. And once you find it, tap on it to select it, then tap on next. And at this point, you should see the health page of the app. Uh, tap on the device icon, tap on add device, tap on OK. It will redirect you to the login page. And basically, you need to log in into Xiaomi account. If you don't have an account, you can always create one by tapping on create account right here. I already have one, so I'm going to log in into it. So I'm gonna enter email and address, give me a couple, I mean email address and password, give me a couple of seconds. Okay, we, can, we need to also check this box right here. Then we can tap on sign in. Oh, apparently entered, I entered the credentials wrong, let me check. What did I mess up? Seems to be okay. Never mind, uh, I entered the password wrong. Okay, and once you log in, you may see more pop-ups about the permissions. This one is for notifications. This is useful if you want to receive the notifications from your iPhone on your watch. So if you want to use that feature, tap on allow. If you don't care, you can deny it. Next, we have the location permission. This is useful for the, for the local weather and some workouts like running, cycling, if you want to track that stuff on the map. If you don't care, you can deny it. If you want to use it, tap on allow. And finally, we can also turn on the sync for the fitness data. So if you want to sync fitness data on all of your devices, so let's say you have more than one device connected to your account, you can tap on OK and it will sync your data. OK, once you're done with the permissions and stuff like that, you will be on the device page. Now tap on Add Device. It will start searching for the nearby devices and it should detect your Redmi Watch 4. Tap on it tap on uh, OK. It will redirect us to settings. We need to tap on Bluetooth. It will start for search, searching for nearby devices. And once it detects the Redmi Watch 4, tap on it. Tap on pair. Tap on the check mark. Once it says connected, we can go back to the Mi Fitness application. Tap on our watch again. Tap on pair, tap on the check mark, allow or deny the permissions for the notifications. Here tap on done, then tap on start on your watch. You should see the watch face on your watch already. Now tap on done again. Go through the tutorial. You can also uh, create goals for your steps, 
calorie balance and stuff like that by tapping on create goals. I'm just going to tap on use, of, use default and then tap on OK. And as you can see, here we have our watch, our Redmi Watch 4. And uh, if you wake up the screen on your watch, you will see that you can use it, which means that the devices are connected. And that's how you pair this watch with the iPhone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving a like on the video.